If the Williams sisters are to face off in Arthur Ashe Stadium once again, it will be in the semifinals. In their long and storied career, Serena and Venus Williams have played each other at the United States Open in the fourth round, the quarterfinals twice and the final twice but never in the tournament in ultimate round. Top-ranked Serena Williams, a six-time United States Open champion who is hoping to pass Steffi Graf's open either record of 22 Grand Slam singles titles, was dealt a challenging path in Friday's draw for the United States Open, which is set to begin Monday. She faces the 2014 semifinally take on Terry Namatharova in the first round, then may meet the former number one Anna Ivanovic in the third round, and the current number five Simona Halep in the quarterfinals. Venus Williams, who at number six has her highest ranking in more than five years, landed in the quarter of the draw with number four Avnetha Radwanska. Williams, 36, reached the semifinals at Wimbledon last month and won the silver medal in mixed doubles at the Rio Olympics. The surprise singles gold medalist Monica Hood of Puerto Rico gained a last-minute seating at number 32 when Sloane Stevens withdrew Friday morning. In the third round, she could meet number three Garbine Mudrita, whom she thrashed 6-1, 6-1 at the Olympics. Number eight Madison Keys and number 28 Coco Thank You Ab are also in Mudrita's quarter, and they could face each other in the third round. Roberta Vinci, last year's surprise finalist is in the bottom quarter with number two Angelique Kerber, who could overtake Serena Williams for the number one ranking if Williams fails to reach the semifinals. Petra Kvyatova, the two-time Wimbledon champion, could face Kerber in the fourth round. Get the big sports news, highlights and analysis from Times journalists, with distinctive takes on games and some behind-the-scenes surprises, delivered to your inbox every week. Novel Djokovic, the men's top seed and defending champion, has a difficult draw of his own, along with a left wrist injury he has been struggling with since the Olympics. He will open against Jerdy J. Noach, a 2013 Wimbledon semifinalist with a booming serve. Djokovic could face another big server, number 20 John Isner, in the fourth round, and has a possible quarter-final matchup against eighth-seeded Marant Silic, the recent Cincinnati champion and 2014 United States Open winner. Number 4 Rafael Nadal and number 5 Milos Raonic Loom as possible semifinal opponents. Two of the most promising American teenagers were placed in the Ecovix quarter, pitted against more established countrymen. Taylor Fritz, 18, will face number 26 Jack Sock, whom he lost to in five tumultuous sets in the first round of the Australian Open. Francis Tiafo, 18, opens against his nerve. Number 14 Nick Kyrgios could face another young Australian, number 17 Bernard Tomic, in the third round, and possibly number 3 Stan Warinka, whom Kyrgios had a dust-up with at a tournament last year, in the fourth round. Warinka, who is seated third because Roger Federer withdrew, has his own early hurdle in the first round against Fernando Verdasco, who upset Nadal in the first round of this year's Australian Open. The standout in Warinka's quarter, however, is Juan Martin Del Potro, who needed a wild card to enter the main draw despite his resurgent form and a silver medal in Rio. Del Potro could face the highest-ranked American man, Steve Johnson, in the second round. Sandy Murray, the Wimbledon champion and Olympic gold medalist, has number six Keina Shikari as the highest seed in his quarter. While the bracket is set for the 250 for main draw matches, there have already been 224 qualifying matches. The most improbable qualifier is 688th ranked Christian Harrison, 22, a once promising American junior who has missed years with myriad injuries and surgeries. He defeated Stephen Diaz of Canada, 1 to 6, 6 to 4, 6 to 2, to reach his first Grand Slam main draw. He joined his older brother, Ryan, who also reached the main draw through qualifying. As Christian walked off the court, he was handed a cell phone. Ryan who was in the midst of playing the world team finish final in Forest Hills, was on the line. Love you, dude, Christian said. C.I. Cybelis, who was a fan favorite at the 2014 United States Open when she advanced to the third round as a 15-year-old, made the main draw of a Grand Slam tournament for the first time since, with a 6-2, 6-7, 5-6-2 victory over Allison Van Duyterian Seatite on Friday. A version of this article appears in print on August 27, 2016.
on page D3 of the New York edition with the headline, William's sisters could be in step for a semifinal showdown.